royalties, GDMI and Jesus Divorce intensifies a new court filing focus on child custody. In this video, we'll be checking out all the latest updates on the GZ and GDMI's divorce. You guys, it's getting messier indeed but before we get right into it hey kings and queens welcome back to the channel it's your girl royalty back with another celebrity relationship just to my returning subscribers you guys at re mvp and if you're new you're so welcome please consider being a part of us by hitting the subscribe button and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video thank you so in the past weeks there have been a lot of updates in the gz and jenny my divorce case first off we saw Jeezy in a conversation with actress Nia Long talking about therapy not being able to save their marriage of which a lot of us were giving it a side eye because given the timeline the situation within which Jeezy filed for the divorce it was quite obvious that he did not even try so talking about therapy not saving their marriage made a lot of people gave him the side eye but then again just as the blogs have believed and have carried on that story Ginny Ma in a recent sit down talk with Jennifer Houston from the Jennifer Houston show talked about learning about the divorce the same time with the people of the internet yes you guys and in a recent court filing Jeezy is talking about Ginny Ma gatekeeping with their daughter Monaco who is one year old let's get into all of those teeth so Ginny Ma and Jeezy have taken their divorce to the next step in recent filing with arguments centered around the custody of their one year old daughter Monaco. you recall the 46 year old rapper Jay Wayne Jenkins aka Jeezy filed for divorce from Jenny Mai 44 year old TV personality in Georgia Superior Court of Fulton County on September the 14th and at the time he claimed that they were living in a bona fide state of separation and that their marriage is irretrievably broken with no hope of reconciliation on a recent November 29 Jennifer Hudson show Jenny Mai said she learned that Jeezy was divorcing her at the same time as the rest of the world she just time when i found out you know at the same time as the rest of the world that my marriage was ending in divorce i was gutted this is what she said i was going through uh, things and marriage ended in divorce and it was kind of hard so yeah it's it's yeah. what i'm dealing with day by day you know she went on to describe her current situation as picking up the pieces discovering herself and being a mom to the best blessing in her life her little girl but as regards their ongoing divorce court case in a motion filed at a Fulton county superior court on november 30th Jeezy requested for a hearing to address the temporary legal and physical custody arrangements involving their daughter monaco as part of the los angeles times he claimed that Ginny mai has acted as a gatekeeper of their child adding that coordinating their responsibilities has become less feasible despite an agreement that he can visit the toddler until the end of the year Ginny mai also filed a counterclaim less than two hours later seeking joint custody but final decision making authority on their custody agreement and primary physical custody on a temporary and permanent basis according to usa today she also requested a fair and equitable distribution of assets that they had acquired together and that Jeezy pay her legal fees Ginny mai I also asked the court to enforce their prenup agreement citing a section on infidelity the clause states that when either party engages in a sexual relationship an emotional relationship or emotional or sexually suggestive in communication with a third party via all forms of electronic communication shall result in a significant financial penalty upon the adulterous party you guys you guys remember the video i shared with you all when this whole divorce news started to spread you can click the card that drops right now to to watch that video that video was a clear indicator that Jeezy could be possibly cheating on Ginny Mai during the marriage and she talking about it in her counter filing talking about a possible infidelity or sexual communication with a third party via an electronic means is a clear indicator that everything I said on that video was most likely correct given the recent filing and counter filing from Jeezy and Ginny Mai a representative for Jeezy has denied Ginny Mai's supposed allegation of infidelity any claim of infidelity on Mr. Jenkins behalf or 
100% false and he has no further statement at this time, the rep said in a statement to People. And also talking about Jeannie Mai gatekeeping with your daughter, on the Jennifer Hudson show, she talked about having plans for the holiday with her daughter, especially her mom has a lot of plans, talking about putting mini Christmas trees in every room in their houses and giving their daughter Monaco, which is her granddaughter, a present every day till Christmas just to make it a special one for the little girl. But Jenny Mai also talked about creating opportunities for her daughter Monaco to spend time with her father so she can also have that whole experience with her father, his culture and everything for the holiday. And then I was trying to live for other people. Now I'm living for what's right and that's my evolution. Okay, so I'm not so sure if she is gatekeeping with a daughter, but what are your thoughts you guys? Do you see Ginny Mai as someone who is gatekeeping her daughter as a way to pay back Jeezy blindsiding her with the divorce? But again, Jeezy talking about equal access to their daughter and Ginny Mai gatekeeping. Is it given that he's just looking for attention given the fact that he's not so much into the lives of his other children that he had with other women from his past? So he is not really into the life of his other children why is Monaco any different? Could it be because that is his legal child from a legal marriage? But your child is your child, it don't matter. You guys share your thoughts in the comment section. What do you think about the recent updates, the filing and counter filing, the gatekeeping and infidelity accusation? Share your thoughts in the comment section and let's continue this conversation in the comments. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you got to this point of the video, do not forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the post notification bell to not miss another video and until the next one remember to pray work out work smart and slay <laughs> bye bye